Hi guys, so this video is probably going to be one of the most viewed in Britain when it comes to the pandemic, and rightly so. It shows an entitlement that is typical to the people who worked for and supported Boris Johnson. Remember, none of this could have happened without senior ministers and likely the Prime Minister himself knowing and authorising it. And as the Twitter account Brexit Fails points out here, two of the people in the video were recently honoured by the disgraced former MP and Prime Minister Boris Johnson. I can't play the clip with audio for copyright reasons, but have a watch. Are you filming this? So they know they're being filmed and they don't care. They know they're being filmed and they believe they'll get away with it. Why? Well, because Boris Johnson's in charge. And the people around Boris Johnson are entitled toffs and they believe that they will get away with it as well because we don't follow the rules. We're, you know, people like Boris Johnson and the people who are, you know, surround him are grown up with this level of entitlement that, yeah, the rules are for everyone else, but we don't have to follow them. And the idea that, I don't know if it's he or she who's asking, are, we, are you filming this, shows a, a level of contempt for the public off the scale. They knew that people, everyone else had to follow the rules. They knew that they had to follow the rules when they were not at number 10. But number 10 provided this sort of island where, you know, we, we don't actually have to follow the guidance or we don't have to do as everyone else has to do. For the party. It's for a party or it's for a party. <laughs> you know, <laughs> Boris Johnson saying no parties took place. Boris Johnson's supporters defending all of this by saying it was just a bit of cake. He was ambushed by, by a bit of cake. Of course, Boris Johnson's not, <clears throat> excuse me, Boris Johnson's not here, but... Boris Johnson obviously and his and his senior people knew about this. You couldn't organize this. And this is I can guarantee you one video of many, because many more are going to come out. Probably much worse than this. This is probably something that was happening every day, if not if not every day, every other day. You know, the the response from his supporters was, well, you know, it's a work event and and people was it flowed back into the garden or whatever. This isn't taking place in a garden, this is taking place inside. But once again, these people didn't care. They believed they would get away with it because the dear leader was in charge and if he was breaking the rules then, and he wasn't punishing anyone else for breaking the rules, then what, what was the point in following the rules, especially at work? As long as we don't stream, I think it means scream, that we're like bending the rules. This is not bending the rules, this is breaking the rules. It's so, you can see just about on the right, it, there's a social distancing poster. Are these people social distancing? Of course not. And you see it even less so in, in a moment. Bending the rules. It's all a joke to them. It's all, it was all a joke to Boris Johnson as well. The fact that he went, you know, to the lecture and every, every night and told people, Follow the rules, save the NH protect the NHS. You know, if you follow the rules, you're going to save people's lives. It was all a joke to them. They didn't care. As I said before, it's this sort of e Etonian entitlement. You know, we are better than everyone else. The rules are for ordinary people, not for us. And the defense of all of this, it was a work event or Boris Johnson didn't know. All a pile of crap. Yeah, there's social distancing for you. But once again, they don't care. They didn't care. And then we have another two toffs here. Now, I don't know which people in this group were honoured by Boris Johnson, but it seems that some of them were. As I said, this could not have happened without the authorization of senior people in number 10, perhaps even including Boris Johnson. They believed they'd get away with it. They believed so because the, the, the guy at the top was just a, sh a, sh a charlatan and a clown. Well, if the clown tells us we can do it, well, then let's do it. I think, as I said, this is just one video of many, I believe, and per perhaps the next ones we're going to see are much worse than this. But remember, 
Ordinary people were told to follow the rules. Ordinary people followed the rules while these people partied. Ordinary people were not able to say goodbye to loved ones. There were heartbreaking stories, you probably saw them yourself, of people, uh, grandchildren, saying goodbye to dying grandparents through windows outside the hospital, looking in over a Zoom call while these people partied. Like Boris Johnson is the one who has resigned over this, but more people have to. Let me know in the comment section, guys, what you think. As always, your comments are greatly appreciated. Thanks a lot.